Hi guys, I hope you are doing well. Welcome to my channel. In this clip I want to introduce a package for having um, fantasy uh, sliders in Unity. Actually, sliders or screw wheels with different shapes and different uh, transition uh, effects. Uh, by the way, sorry for my voice, I have cold, but I'm still alive. Okay, and first we should take a look at this package. Sechi released this package almost four years ago, which called Fancy Scroll View. You just need to download the whole project uh, by download zip. I will share the link of this package in the description of this video. After that, import the assets folder into your projects folder or even just this folder. Fancy scroll view. Okay, now we should take a look at this package over here. It has examples and there is nine example scenes. First, take a look at the first one. Okay, look at this. It is really beautiful. There is 19 items, actually in fact 20 because it starts from uh, zero. So we have 20 items here with this animation. But the item, uh, as we can see, it is just uh, you know, eight items here. They are moving with uh, the uh, object pooling system. How we can fit these contents, uh, as you can see in the sources folder 01, the basic folder, we have the components here, and here we have a scroll view, and a scroll view which uh, has a cell prefab. If you click on this guy, it is the, just the image of that uh, item and the text over here but the cell itself has cell a script in this part you can call this function and fit the item with any content you want or even you can make uh, your own feeding system or content make a system for your items and you can add anything you want uh, instead of these even even these um, prefab okay let's go to the next one at this part it is exactly the same with the basic one but it is focused on items look at this it's focused on for example the center one index 4 index 5 6 7 and it works with these buttons as well it works with the slider and uh, it works with uh, you know buttons, and you can use this index number to uh, to you know understand okay what is this uh, selected item, and you can do whatever you want. At this part here, we have scroll view. We can change any parameter we want, even change the you know interval of the cells or here we can change the scroll offset look at this okay let's go to the third uh, scroll view it is infinite a scroll actually look at this it is really fantastic and you can select anything you want but it doesn't end after 19 it goes to cell 0 again so it is in fact infinite and it's come back and going forward this is really beautiful and the metal ball it is really beautiful and you know awesome slider i've never seen something like this before even in any game look at this is really beautiful you can change the items over here by changing the content or the cell prefab or even the, the background okay let's go to the number five Bernie Bernie 
Portnoy, sorry. Look at this, it is fantastic as well. For cartoony and, no, uh, how can I say? Yeah, fantasy games. It is really beautiful. And this thick one. Look at this. In fact, it is just three items. Number zero, one, and two. But it makes your slider infinite. Look at this. You always have the items. If you want to add more, you can add more easily. Look at this. At this part, at the tabs, you can add any items you want. At this part, the content, we have just four tabs. Okay, and the screw view, but at this part, in fact, you can see the list of your cells with this effect, beautiful effect. You can change the, uh, you know, padding tab, for example, 20, uh, look at this. And in here, you can say uh, content can be, for example, any number you want. And the selected number, for example, it is number 10 or now in number 11. But it said alignment is equal middle. Look at this. If you say the upper, so your selected item can, uh, must be the upper number. If you say the middle, your selected number comes to the middle and lower goes here. For example, if I select 7, it goes to the lower. And middle, it's here. It is really beautiful. At this part, we have something like 2D items, but more items, almost 100 items. But that is, it is the same method here for alignment. Middle and upper and lower. 80. 71, 56, 47, or anything you want. And the last one is really beautiful because you can even make the picture sliders. Look at this. You can replace any image or photos instead of these textures, actually. Even you can come back to the first screen and go faster to this guy okay i hope this tutorial will be helpful for you don't hesitate to ask any question related to unity ar vr and xr subscribe to my channel and like this video if you like it have a great time bye bye